<laughs> I'm not a clubber, but I went clubbing. He's a clubber, it He's, turns out. Uh, well, I want to yeah. pack, unpack this more. What was yeah. your so on Monday night? What did was, you wear to the yeah. club? Oh, I look good. <laughs> what a G star? I, no, G -star? I went to I bet diesel. you diesel. I knew yeah, it. I went to I diesel knew and I got a whole diesel. Because I have there's bottom. some old diesel clothes here. I'm like, who wears this stuff? <laughs> I, did, I did. Bobby Lee. I had like a Von Dutch hat. Yeah. The whole get up. The whole oh, my vagina yeah. just like I had like a, a wristband, wristband that said Ed Hardy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Affliction shirt? Yeah, yeah I had Affliction. the whole thing. I had the whole my thing. vagina just ate itself. Right, right. Oh, God. So oh, then yeah. I would like and I would powder. And I would come to these clubs and I would dance, right? Oh, my God. He walks in dancing already. Yeah, I would come in dancing. <laughs> he walks in dancing. So I would go to the, on Monday nights. There was this place called Joseph's. Of course, you'd go to a place called Joseph's. And it was on Monday nights. It was over there on um, near Vine. Vine. Mm -hmm. And it was a hot spot Monday nights. Everyone went. Mm -hmm. Okay. Shut the fuck up, dog. <laughs> and so I was at the comedy store, and Bonnie goes, "You you can get us in the clubs." I go, "You guys want to go to jo Joseph's right now? I got a guy, Andrew, mm -hmm. right?" And <laughs> came with us. Okay. And we had a great night. You guys are still cool. Yeah. yeah. But immediately after, he got <laughs> as a writing gig too. Yeah, yeah. And to be on it. And then he saw me a couple years after that, and he said, "What are you doing here?" And it really hurt my feelings. Interesting. It, it it when things like that happen, it devastates me. Because it's like we went clubbing. I got you into this. I got you into this thing. Okay, so are, are people obligated to like you? So are are people like? Let's say you guys hung out, right? He didn't like your vibe. Your codes didn't match, and then he decided for himself. Hey, I don't like Bobby Lee. I don't know what it is about him, but I'm not gonna fake it or try to be nice to him. All right, Joe Rogan and I. Joe Rogan and I aren't best friends, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see when I see Joe, we he we hug, we say, "I love you, buddy. I love you, man." I mean, there's respect there. I like him a lot. I really do. I think he's great. But we're not like I don't go to his house and barbecue. I don't go hunting with him. Yeah. Right. But a long time ago, when I was living in San Diego, and he was headlining the La, Jo La Jolla Comedy Store, we went to a strip club and we almost died. What? <sighs> Unpack that. And we almost died at the strip club. Okay. Because this man with tattoos on his face, right, approached us like, I said something to his girl, like, hey, baby, you got nice ass cheeks. You did? Yeah. Well, there you go. <laughs> and this guy with a tattoo on his face, he goes, what'd you say, bro? And then Joe, and he was with a couple of other guys. I think Jimmy Schubert was there. And we stood up, and then he, he turned to his friend and goes, hey, bro, let's go to the car to get a gun or something. Who oh, did? The fuck. guy with the tattoo face? Yeah, tattoo face. And then Joe Rogan goes, let's get out of here, right? And I go, I called Joe Rogan a pussy. I go, hey, pussy. And no, he talks about this on stage. Yeah. yeah. Like, hey, pussy, they're not going to do nothing, right? And we almost died. Did okay? they come out with guns? No, but we could have died. Damn. Who knows? But we had that experience together. Okay, so. So what I'm saying is, is that Joe will always bring that experience up. It's positive and negative, right? It's when I first met him. But it is something that happened, and there's a bond there. It's hmm. like two people at war together Did i get that. Have that so when you were when you went out with were you still drinking no you're sober so my okay. question is something must have happened for him to be like you know what i fucking don't like that guy and i'm not gonna fake it he doesn't respect he, he there's there's people i think we should ask him no no there are people <laughs> out there i'm gonna be real there are people <laughs> out there I'll, I'll say it right now i'm gonna tell you right now yeah there's a casting director 